Hey everybody, what's going on? Speedy Diver here, and this is night 560 of GameStop Dumpster Diving. So tonight there are two bags, woo! That means twice the odds of finding goods, like goody goodies. Yes, finding cool loot, just cool promo stuff, cool games, controllers, anything you could think of. I have probably most likely found it. It's freaking awesome what can be found, GameStop Dumpster Diving, and tonight two bags, twice the odds. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you consider subscribing if you enjoy the video make sure you watch it till the end also I do have a couple codes to give away I'm gonna be giving them away in just a second so here are the Pokemon codes I'm gonna be giving three of these away there is code number one code number two and code number three Three. So I do have a couple of these actually left. I don't have too too many. I think there's maybe like five or six actually left of those. Gonna be giving them all the way to you guys as I throw them in like the dark abyss over there. <laughs> it's like super dark over there. But uh, either way, there's still these two bags and I ended up getting sunburned over the weekend and it looks really bad. It looks worse in person. So yeah. Really bad, but it doesn't matter. I just wanted to let you guys know why I'm so red. And let's get into this bag. First thing that's really interesting about this one, right here, the Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. I don't think it's the actual game case. I think it's one of those sleeves that goes over the actual game, but hey, it's worth a shot to check it out. I have no idea. And let's get into the bag. Also, if you are new to the channel, do consider following me on my social medias like Instagram and Twitter. Because if you do, once I hit 10,000 Instagram followers, gonna be doing a gift card giveaway. Let's see, get a, a bag. And let's see what we have here. We have, ooh, we have two things. We have the Witcher, yeah, it is the Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. It is a sleeve, like I said, that goes over the actual game, which is pretty cool. I have found a lot of these in the past, but they're still really cool to find. I feel like putting this over a game makes the game feel that much more special. I don't know why, it's just something about these sleeves that are just so cool. So that is find number one for tonight. We have Need for Speed Hot Pursuit. This is an actual sleeve that goes in a case and has a map and everything, that's kinda cool. I'm gonna keep that even though it is really like, it looks like it was all wrinkled up and stuff. Just a little bit, I'm still gonna keep it, looks pretty cool. Ooh, what's up? It's like a sticker. Come on, something else. Oh, broken rubber band, come on. Broken rubber band, I was gonna say rubber band squad. Let's see what we got here, we have some nice cardboard. Oh, we have a case, yeah, it is a case. We have a PS4 sleeve for Battle Star Wars Battlefront. And the manual's inside, is there any codes? Codes, codes, codes. Nope, I don't think there's any codes in any of this. But still, it is really cool to find a manual and a sleeve to Star Wars Battlefront for the PS4. A lot of sleeves so far. Pretty cool. There is a case though. Monster 4x4 World Circuit. I don't think I've ever actually found this case before. I'm hoping the game's inside. It is! Oh, no way. The game is actually in there. I was not expecting that. I haven't found a Wii game in quite some time in the case. Freaking awesome! There is the manual, kinda. It's all like ripped up and stuff, but I mean, hey, it is in there, heck yeah. Freaking awesome, oh, that is such a cool find. Let's check the condition of it really quickly. If I can get this back in without ripping it, cause it's already pretty ripped. That is so cool. The condition, mmm, that's actually pretty good. Way better than I thought, nice. Freaking awesome. I was not expecting that. That is such a cool find. Yes. So, so cool. Let's see what else is in here. Ooh, what is that black thing? No games in these. What is that? Is this a wallet? This is a wallet. Ooh, what? What just fell out of it? A freaking coin. No way. What kind of coin is it? Oh, okay, it's a US coin. I thought it was like something like from a different country or something. It just looked really weird. Is that Mount Rushmore? It is Mount Rushmore. <laughs> Freaking, there's money! The what? There's actually money? It's there's coins falling out of the flipping wallet. What? Oh, that's so cool. Where are the coin? Oh, I think I just saw one. Where is it? Are they in here? Where the heck are they? What? Wait, yeah, there's still coins in it. Oh, there's a zipper! The in- What? No! No way! There's a flipping zipper! What?
What? Oh, that is so cool. I'm, I don't think I've ever found a wallet with change in it before. I have found wallet. I think I found a wallet with a dollar in it once. And, uh, like, there was, like, a WWE card in it, I think, also. Like, a couple, like, a very long time ago. Flipping coins. What? <laughs> I'm, I'm, like, in shock right now. This is so weird. Freaking, oh, how much do we have here? We have, there's at least a dollar right there. There is a dollar. We have two more. It's a dollar fifty. Dollar fifty. Uh, we have dollars sixty, dollars seventy, seventy-five, seventy-six, seventy-seven, seventy-eight, seventy-nine, eighty. A dollar eighty. That was in the wallet, and there might even be like cards in here or something. Like maybe I didn't see any cash. Let's see if we can find someone's ID to return it to them. No, it looks like someone actually just literally took everything out of it and just tossed it out with change in it. That is so weird. And there's a secret compartment in the back. I didn't even see it at first. If coins didn't fall out of it, I would have never known how to get into it. What? That is so cool. I just found a wallet. I don't know. What kind of wallet is it? It feels fake, though. It doesn't feel like real leather. It feels like a pleather kind of feel to it. Ooh, it looks like the symbol was actually, whatever it was, was ripped off. It's a very thin wallet. What? I just can't believe this. This is so cool. <laughs> I was not expecting to find a wallet tonight. That is so, so cool. Freaking dope. A flipping wallet full of cash. Well, not cash, but money. A wallet full of money. Oh, that is so dope. That is such a legit find right there. A wallet full of money. Like, who would have thunk? Who would have thunk? That's not even a word, but it's still cool. I'm freaking out. Found <laughs> a wallet. That is so, so cool. And $1.80 worth of money right here. I can go to the local like store and just go buy a drink and maybe like a little snack. That is so cool. That is so, so cool. Let's see what else is in here. Oh, I'm, I'm just happy about that. That is that's so cool. I usually find change on the bottom of bags, but to find change in a wallet it just makes it that much cooler. Oh, we have a Pokemon Soul Silver case. Come on, my luck is so good tonight. Ah, oh, nothing in it, just an empty DS case. The luck, the luck of dumpster diving gods is on our side tonight. Oh, <gasps> you guys know what time it is? Rubber band squad. Woo! Let's see what else is in here. Come on, come. Ooh, ooh, this is a new one. I haven't seen one of these in quite some time. It's blue rubber band squad. Ooh, hashtag blue rubber band squad in the comments below. Do it, guys. You got to do it. If you are in the rubber band squad, blue rubber band squad in the comments. Let's see. I think I see something else in here as well. Another DS case for Kirby Superstar Ultra. Come on, Kirby. Not in there. <laughs> I don't know why I said that's so weird. What's this? That's a candy. I didn't know what that was at first. Ooh. Ooh. Nintendo DS, Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare for the DS. Not in there, but I'll keep it. Another DS case. Come on, anything else in here? Ooh, coin roll. Another rubber band. Gotta get it. See if there's any change in the bottom of this bag, because maybe some change in the wallet fell out. I mean, I always go to the bottom of the bag, because you never, ever know. But, like These are giant mystery bags. That's what I call these. I call these mystery bags for a reason. That is super random. <laughs> but uh, that is gonna be it for this bag. Let's check out the second bag. That, like I said, ooh, I didn't even see that. What is that? It's a DS case. I didn't even notice that. Freaking cool. Okay, let's get into the bag. This bag was super hard to open. And the reason I do call these mystery bags is because I don't know what's inside. And it's just all a mystery. Ooh, there's an actual GameStop bag in the bag. Look at that. These bags, usually when I find these, these are loaded with amazingly good items because they're thicker material bags. They can hold heavier weights, so they put bigger, heavier, awesomer items in these. Uh, <laughs> and there's stuff right here. Maybe that bag had stuff in it and they poured it in this bag? Oh my god, come on, jackpot tonight. There's a flipping Wii controller skin. There's at least two DS cases, Pokemon Black version 2. Let's check it out. Uh, no game inside. For the most part, DS cases really don't have the games in them. I believe GameStop takes the games out of cases and they put them in like little like plastic sleeve things. So we got another game right here. Super Mario DS. Uh, not in there either. Bunch of DS cases though. And a Wii controller skin that's really yellow. Yeah, it's like a super yellow skin. Ugh. But I'll keep it. <laughs> and another rubber band. Oh yeah. Rubber band squad. Ooh. And a paperclip. Okay. Let's see what else is in here. 
Is that a bag in the bag? Oh, it is. Okay, that's confusing. There's our drink. Is that gonna be it? Is that it for this little bag? Like I said, the bag was decently heavy for its size. It was a really, really tiny bag. And I believe that is going to wrap it up for bag number two. A freaking wallet full of money though. I can't get over that. That is the, ooh. <gasps> that quarter just rolled. That is such a cool find. A flipping dollar eighty in a wallet. I might even use this while, oh wait, is it ripping? It looks like it's actually ripping right there. Like I was gonna say, I might even be able to use this wallet if I can still use it, like if it's functional. It looks like it's actually like a good wallet. It definitely feels like a kind of like a cheaper wallet, but still a freaking wallet nonetheless with a dollar eighty inside. I, that is the best find tonight, in my opinion. I want to know in the comments below. Let me know what you guys think is the coolest find tonight. I think it's the money. I mean, that's just me, but I think that's really cool. Also, there's all of this stuff. We have so many DS cases. We have one, two three, four, and five. We also have a Wii controller skin, a couple rubber bands to add to the rubber band ball. I'm gonna update that video very soon. Be ready for it. Also, the only game tonight, Monster 4x4 World Circuit for the Wii. I can't wait to test this game out. I wanna see if this game actually works and I wanna see how much fun it is. It looks flipping awesome. That looks so, so cool. There is also the Witcher 3 Wild Hunt sleeve for the Xbox One that goes over the case. An actual sleeve for Xbox 360, which is the Need for Speed Hot Pursuit. And we also have the Star Wars Battlefront PS4 sleeve with some manuals as well, which is pretty cool to add to a PS4 case. So make sure if you guys did like the video, you like, share, subscribe, so I know you guys really enjoyed it because tonight was freaking awesome. Yes, a wallet with a $1.80. Like, I, I can't believe, like, literally almost $2 worth of change right here in a flipping wallet. A lot of people don't care about change because it's just change. Like, everyone's like, oh, I want paper money. Hey, this stuff adds up. It really does. You find a quarter, maybe one day. Maybe you find, like, a 75 cents the next. You got a dollar right there. Like, that actually adds up. And people don't realize that but change adds up for sure I definitely keep all the change I find and I collect and I find in the road and just anywhere you can find change I always keep it because it adds up for sure but if you guys did enjoy tonight's video I will leave the last video over there the most recommended one over here subscribe to the speedy gamer my gaming channel and subscribe to the speedy diver thank you all so much for watching and like I always say in my videos I truly love making these and showing you guys what can be found in the world of dumpster diving and without further ado I will catch all of you on the flip side.